It's a beautiful morning here in Grand Teton National Park and today we are hiking the Taggart and Bradley Lake Loop. It is about a six mile trail with a little under 800 feet of elevation gain so nothing too intense today. It is a stunning morning out here. The temperatures are great. It's supposed to get pretty hot today, almost 90 degrees, and it's quiet on the trail so far. We got here at 7 a.m. and it's a Saturday, so I'm expecting it to get pretty busy later on today, but thankfully the trail is nice and quiet now and we're super excited to check out this hike. We are about a minute from the parking lot and you can see the views are incredible right off of the bat. That is the Grand Teton right there. This hike was especially beautiful in the early morning with the sun shining through the pine and aspen trees. Taggart Lake is one of the clearest alpine lakes in Wyoming, so we were really looking forward to checking it out. We passed over a rushing river and we could already tell this was going to be a great day. Over the past week, we've been lucky enough to see some wildlife earlier this week. We actually came to Grand Teton just for a quick evening trip after work. We were hiking to a lake called Phelps Lake and we saw a black bear in the woods, so that was really cool. And then yesterday we were driving and on the side of the road we saw three huge moose. So who knows, maybe we'll see something else today. We just saw a mama moose and her baby moose. <laughs> Definitely a little bit crazy to see. They were pretty close to the trail, <laughs> but so incredible. They're just so majestic and wow. <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted to happen today. So incredible to see them. And I'm sure they're pretty used to people. This is an incredibly popular trail, but you know, we're very cautious. We make noise when we're hiking so that any animals are aware of our presence before we arrive. But wow, <laughs> so awesome. Still feeling so excited from seeing those moose. And now we're getting close to Taggart Lake. So we're gonna head to Taggart Lake first, even though the map that we're following recommends we go to Bradley Lake first, but I'm pretty sure that Taggart Lake is much more popular as far as we can tell. So we're gonna head there first. Hopefully it's a little bit less crowded than it will be later in the morning and then head to Bradley Lake second. So we're here at Taggart Lake and I'm trying to be quiet because it is so quiet here right now. So peaceful and calm. And we have the incredible reflection on the water because the water is still so calm this morning. We've been here once in the winter before we snowshoed here. And of course the lake was entirely frozen over, so much snow. So to see this in the summer is really something so special. Although we could have happily spent all day at that first lake, we got back on the trail to keep on hiking and began making our way to Bradley Lake. We're getting pretty close to Bradley Lake and we just came upon this great view of Taggart Lake from up above. It still looks like it's so still and calm. I am an orchard at the start of spring. I am a mockingbird, I love to sing, and I'm on a fly, I'm gonna fly. Bradley Lake was just as stunning with another perfect reflection of the mountains above shining down onto the water. The scenery in Grand Teton is just unmatched, an and while there are plenty of fantastic hikes in the park, feet. this one felt extra special. I am laughing the weeping willow tree I am a dog barking a 
We just spent some time relaxing at Bradley Lake. It was absolutely spectacular. This has been such a great hike. It's so nice to be able to visit two lakes in one loop, visiting Taggart Lake and Bradley Lake. And it's not too difficult of a hike either. You get six miles and only, I think I mentioned a little under 800 feet of elevation gain. So it wasn't too steep and you just have incredible views, amazing forest for the entire hike. So we probably have about two or three miles left back to the car. So we're gonna head there now. Today has been such a perfect day in Grand Teton National Park. I would highly recommend this hike. Not only was that incredible, but seeing the moose, the mama moose and the baby moose was such a highlight. Definitely something we're not going to forget. So we're gonna wrap up the video here. Thank you so much for watching. If you're not already, we'd love if you liked and subscribed to our channel. Thank you again, and we'll see you on the next adventure. So just a quick side note before we go, this is what the parking lot looked like at 7 a.m. when we arrived, and this is what it looked like when we got back to the trailhead. It was full and there were cars parked all the way down the side of the road. If you're planning on doing this hike, we'd highly recommend getting there as early as possible. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you on the next adventure.